Hello, YouTube land. It's me, Jacob, uh, for a new video with Jacob's stuff. Uh, as you subscribers, long-time subscribers would know, this time of the month usually means a new shit from the shit hits the fan subscription box from Bud K. So this month, I've got another small box, unfortunately, but uh, better than nothing. Um, especially since I'm running low on money. Uh, hey, if uh, you want to donate. Please do so. Uh, I've got a Patreon page, which I'll you can go to the end of any video and it'll be there. Um, I think that's it, really, it for donations. But I think that I'm not. I'm almost positive you can do the uh, one on the front page too, with uh, I think the super chat thing. Uh, anyways, enough talking. So here's today's box, it's small, unfortunately, like I said, and this month I'm using one of my uh, favorite knives, which is sort of falling apart because the, uh, uh, the screws that they put on this, I've replaced most of them as you can see, this one and this one and this one, but this is the original one that's left, only one. The screws stink and they shear and they just fall right out basically so I have to replace them uh, so anyways it's a uh, Smith & Wesson uh, power glide which is also another disconnect uh, uh, sorry I'm a little off today discontinued knife but uh, has a tanto tip and uh, it opens like this and it just slides place and clicks Anyways, let's open the box. Let's see what we got this month. Okay, so I'll start from the bottom. Doesn't really matter where I start. This knife is pretty sharp. Just gotta get it in there. There we go, it should be open for now. Ow, I think I almost just gave myself a paper cut there. <laughs> Whatever. Anyways, people, if you if you want to uh, pick one of my knives from my collection, uh, go to the, one of the previous video. I think it's uh, April's video. Uh, part two shows you all the knives I presently have, except for one, which I got. Uh, basically, ooh, and of course the usual brown paper. Sorry for whoever's using earphones. Let's see, what do we have this month? Looks like we got <laughs> got a piece of beef jerky this month. Smoked buffalo and beef jerky, buffalo bobs, jerky. Well, I like jerky, so I'll probably eat this almost right away. So I'm going to keep that right here. Next. Oh my god, finally. Something I actually want. Because the multi-tool I have on my keychain sucks ass. Uh, but hey, it was only five bucks. But uh, this one's from uh, Trailblazer. It's a pocket multi-tool. That's cool. I'm going to add that to my keychain and take the other one off. And then next, we've got also from Trailblazer a carabiner set. A bunch of carabiners. Different colored ones. Black one, gray one, I guess a camo colored one, uh, orange, and a different shade of black. I think that's gunmetal actually, to be precise. Next, awesome, I've been wanting to get one of these. Finally, Bud K is listening to me. <laughs> Maybe. So th this is uh, um, when you're in a survival situation and you need to make a spear, 
you know, for fishing. That's what this is. See? And, you know what? I'm looking at that beef jerky. It's making me hungry. And next in the box, and possibly last in the box, unless you count that card. And I did I did get myself a vapor clip. Uh, anyways, the Combat Commander Gladius Dagger by United Cutlery. This is actually not that bad of a box this month. Okay, I need a knife to open a knife. See, one thing I like about this knife is you can totally, like, use one-handed to open it. Do I need it? Yeah. Okay, there's the tape. I want to see what this looks like. And you can close it one-handed. Sort of. Six minutes into the video for those who care. Alright, let's see how to open this box inside the box. This looks. So yeah, here's it inside the sheath with the plastic salon. Got a little button clasp thingy here, which is kind of hard to open. But that's, I guess that's good. <laughs> it's exactly what I thought it was going to be. Look at that. It's like the smaller ver version of their uh, um, the Gladius sword thingy that they have. And it seems to also have... Uh, is this full tank? I'm almost positive this is full tank. And uh, at the bottom it has one of those glass breaker things, which is pretty cool. Let me take the plastic throw it inside the box so I can put this back in. But this is kind of cool. Uh, high carbon steel combat mission. Okay. Okay. So this is kind of cool. Sheath is your normal sheath quality, but it looks like it's slightly better. Hmm. Nice, no, another nice little knife from our collection. Put that to the side. And way on the bottom of the box, practically almost missable, is the uh, little survival tip card that they have and the little advertisement on the back to buy the uh, um, Oh man, that's something mine didn't have. That sucks. Well, what's this? Did I miss something? No, okay. Mine didn't. The I guess this is for the pro box. Mine didn't have a life straw. I've been wanting one of those life straws for a while. Uh, plus, I think their kind of carabiner set is a lot cooler than mine. Mine's sort of plain. Anyways, uh, let's see what's the survival tip of this month while I have time. Okay, uh, person can only survive three days without water. Among other ways, you can look for lush green vegetation or damp patches of earth when trying to find water. Swimming, uh, swarming insects and areas where animals tracks cross are also good indica indicators that there is water in the area. Okay. Anyhow, that's it for this video for this month. Not too much stuff to go through. Uh, anyways, uh, subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Like, comment, all those stuff, all that good stuff. And uh, hopefully next month is a bigger box. But this month wasn't too bad. Um, I'm gonna open up this beef jerky and eat it. Uh, but yeah, um, most likely by this point in time in the video, the already the little button things will be down here in the bottom right hand corner uh, and in the upper right hand corner as well. Um, those are for the subscribe button, the Patreon button, and the button to go to all of my previous videos. Uh, the view count 
so far on my channel is I think about I think it's not that much it's like 1200 but anyways I'm gonna get going so I'll see you next time bye YouTube land